the sustainability problem of blockchain, NFT and Web3 and how we tackle it. The problem is that blockchain, the distributed decentralized system that helps verify crypto transaction and records the ownership of NFTs, requires a massive amount of computing power and therefore electricity. And as the NFT marketplace and other Web3 technologies continue to expand, the environmental impact of blockchain has been growing. Bitcoin, the world's largest cryptocurrency, consumes an estimated 150 terawatt hours of electricity every year. That's an amount that is equivalent to the entire country of Argentina. Producing that much energy emits approximately 65 megatons of carbon dioxide into the atmosphere on an annual basis. As society's thirst for Web3 technology continues to grow, the industry will have to find ways to be more sustainable. So let's look at some of the ways blockchain, cryptocurrency and NFTs might transition to greener technologies and more sustainable energy sources. Embracing more energy efficient blockchain systems. Many of the world's most popular cryptocurrencies, including Bitcoin, depend on energy inefficient problem solving systems known as proof of work, where miners compete with one another to see who can problem solve the fastest in exchange for crypto rewards. This process takes up a large amount of energy. Proof of stake systems, on the other hand, rely on market incentives where validators put down a stake or deposit in exchange for the right to add blocks to the blockchain. And removing the competition element from the system massively reduces energy consumption. Ethereum, the world's second biggest cryptocurrency and home of many NFTs, recently completed its switch over from proof of work to proof of stake algorithms. And this led to a reported 98% reduction in the overall amount of energy used on the network. Adoption of renewable energy sources. One clear way to make blockchain more sustainable is to run it with solar power and other green energy sources. For example, Genesis Mining, which is based in Iceland, is one of the largest miners in the world and it uses 100% renewable energy and enables mining in the cloud. For me, the challenge here is still opportunity costs for, the, for using the energy, as there are so many important systems competing for the limited amount of energy available in our world today. Having said this all, there's another side to blockchain. It might actually be a powerful technology to help us in the fight against climate change. Blockchain could be a very useful technology in pollution monitoring and tracking the sustainability of products. Blockchain, NFT and Web3 technology has huge potential and the space is developing rapidly with new innovations emerging all the time. So to stay on top of everything in this space, subscribe to my channel and my podcast, follow me on social media and check out my books Tech Trends in Practice and Business Trends in Practice, which just won the 2022 Business Book of the Year Award.